Hello all and thanks again for watching my channel. Today I bring to you this beautiful scale balance that I made using items from the dollar store. And this is actually a plunger, believe it or not. So stay with me to see how I make this beautiful scale. So for starters, I thought of using one of these candle holders as a base and I went ahead and painted it black with this glossy paint. But later in this video, I realized that this bottom part of the plunger was a more sturdier uh, base for it. So I ended up not using the candle holder. And I have here one complete plunger plus one more of the sticks, which I pre-drilled some holes to the side. And I'm adding these caps that I just happen to have lying around just for decorative purposes. You can leave it as is or you can try to find something similar. I'm using double-sided foamy tape and some E6000 to add these caps to the ends. And yeah, just basically stay with me. I'm going to go ahead and paint this stick with the glossy black paint as well. So once I had them both painted, I went ahead and let this dry for a couple of hours. And now I'm going to be adding one more of those caps that I painted in black to the top of my scale. And like I said, this is just for decorative purposes. Um, you can try to find something similar or you could just leave it as is. So what you see me doing here is just adding two parts of the foamy double-sided tape just to give it a more um, snug fit to this cap that I had. It was a little uh, bigger than my stick but um, with some E6000 glue and the adhesive that this double-sided tape had, it ended up fitting very snugly and it stayed. So I went ahead and measured the stick that's going to go across my scale and I'm using a little bit of the uh, hot glue to just center it and I'm going to be drilling a hole through this. I have here a long nail that's going to go all the way through to the other part of the stick which is uh, going to be the stand for this. So that's what I'm doing here in this part. adding a little dab of black paint just to cover up the nail and like I said I ended up using the base of the plunger and not this candle holder so um, now I have here two candle holders that I also got from the dollar store which are really cute they have their own wire hanger on the top which I don't have to add uh, more chain to it I also got these scented candles that I'm going to be placing in the center of it with a little hot glue. And I also have this uh, garden chain, or for it's used more for planters. And I'm going to be using this, I'm going to be cutting one of these chains in half to use for both sides of my scale. Uh, these chains allowed me to open up one of the uh, hooks and I just stuck it right through the holes that I had drilled on my on the stick that's going across the scale and yeah that's what I'm doing right here I, I used a screwdriver and I used a 
pliers to open them up. You can use whatever you need. If you are gonna be doing this DIY, um, I, I recommend that you get one of these chains. They, uh, they're really easy to work with. So the way I made it stay is that I opened up one of these chains and I left it like, um, I picture it like a bobby pin and I just stuck it right through the hole and then opened up both sides of the chain and it held to the, uh, the stick as I'm going to show you in the end. And I do apologize, my lighting is not that great, but I hope you can see what I did with this chain and how it's gonna be holding on to the top of the scale. So here you just see me trying to open up one of the uh, chains um, like I did with the first one and this is the one that's going to go on the other side. So the way I decorated this scale, um, I got some of these uh, food picks from the party section on, at the 99 cent store and I just glued on four of them. I, What I did was just lay them flat on there and I just put some hot glue and glued them facing each other and I also used these um, napkin rings from the dollar store to decorate the bottom part of the uh, plunger so that it wouldn't show so much that it was a plunger. And I also added one of these uh, plates that I also got from the dollar store. They, they come six in a pack. So I just glued it to the bottom part of it, the plunger. And this is where I'm showing you with better lighting how the chain looks um, hooked up on the top of the stick and I hope you can see that. Now I'm just going to be adding my candle holders to the chain and I'm also going to be adding some flowers to these so that um, I don't know I don't I don't know if I'm going to be using the the candles for now but just for decorative purposes I'm going to be adding a few of these uh, flowers and this is also from the dollar store I just cut it and it gave me three pieces for each of the um, candle holders. So this is just to give you an idea of how to decorate it. You can use flowers, you can use succulent plants, or you can also use other kinds of candles for this. Um, I just happen to have these on hand. And 
and this is how my scale turned out to look like I hope you enjoyed watching me make this if you have any questions in regards to this scale go ahead and leave me some comments and I'll try to get back to you on those um, give it a thumbs up thank you so much for watching my channel and if you have any ideas or any suggestions or any other DIY that you would like me to do as a challenge go ahead and leave a comment in the bottom and I will try to please you know depending on what you want me to do so thanks so much for watching my channel and please subscribe like and share and I'll see you again